hello friends good evening to all of you in this video we are going to discuss about the human brain and its parts human brain so first of all uh, we have to see the functions of brain like uh, like the brain helps your body to control and to maintain the interaction and coordination between different different organs then it also helping your uh, endocrine system the main gland of your endocrine system which is pituitary gland it is controlling that gland so that that gland will control the other glands then uh, your brain is the central processing organ it analyzes it uh, uh, processes the information which comes from your senses like uh, your uh, vision then your uh, hearing then speech then thinking these are the functions of brain so it is uh, also uh, controlling your involuntary organs like kidney uh, then uh, heart and uh, it is also controlling your thermoregulation so these are the main main functions of brain it also controls the balance of the body if we want to see where it is located so we all know that suppose this is your skull and we all know that our skull has this cranium made up of eight bones and brain is protected in this uh, cranial bones right so brain will be present suppose this is your head and brain will be something present in this region like this like this this is your brain okay so brain is present in your cranial bones of the skull and it is covered by a three layer tissue called cranial meninges cranial meninges so suppose this is the outer layer which is called dura mater then this is the middle layer middle thin layer called arachnoid mater arachnoid arachnoid mater i hope it is visible then the innermost layer which is in touch with the brain called pyometer so brain is covered and protected uh, by these three layers by these three layers and they are collectively called as cranial meninges cranial meninges okay so this is one thing you have to remember the outer layer is dura mater this is present on the outer side the inner layer is the pia mater it is present with the brain uh, which which is in contact with the brain and the middle is arachnoid mater and collectively these three called cranial meninges then if you divide your brain this is a uh, brain so the brain can be divided into three different parts called forebrain forebrain then midbrain and hindbrain hindbrain forebrain midbrain and hindbrain so your forebrain is uh, the major part of your brain it is also divided into three different regions or cerebrum cerebrum then thalamus and hypothalamus 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 then your midbrain uh, having a uh, four lobe structure present on the dorsal side called 
corpora quadrigenera quadrigenera and then hind brain is again divided into three different parts which is pons medulla and cerebellum so this is how you can divide your brain parts for brain midbrain hind brain fore brain is divided into three parts cerebrum don't confuse it with cerebellum cerebrum thalamus hypothalamus okay these are the parts of fore brain then midbrain is having four lobe structure called corpora quadrigenera okay then hind brain is again divided into three parts pons medulla and cerebellum we are going to talk about more, uh, in more detail about all these three structures for brain midbrain and hind brain but not in this video we will make separate videos about them so in this video we are only covering the introductory part of the brain which is given in the ncrt so i hope it is helpful to you if you like this video please hit the like button share this video with your friends thank you so much